tonight we are cooking sirloin steak from Home Chef. So the first thing you really want to do is read the before you cook section. And it says to preheat the oven at 400 degrees, set the butter on a counter to soften, rinse the produce, and prepare a baking sheet. So here's our steak, and here's the potatoes, the herbs, the garlic, we have truffle oil, green beans, but in our box should have been butter, and there's no butter, so we're going to have to use our own butter, but there was another experience already where we ordered a box and we were missing some herbs, so sometimes it can be a little clumsy. So it says to set butter on the counter to soften, trim the green beans, and we're going to cut the potatoes and stem the parsley. So we're cutting the potatoes into like half inch sticks, like french fry style. Well, we tried. Gonna mince the garlic. Garlic is minced. So we've got the potatoes cut and the green beans cut and now we're going to mince the herb. So now we're going to rinse the steaks, pat dry and season both sides with a pinch of salt and pepper. It's like a pinch! <laughs> It really did say a pinch. I don't know nothing. <laughs> Never follows directions. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm gonna go ahead and toss the potatoes together with truffle oil, one teaspoon of olive oil, and a pinch of salt and pepper on a baking sheet. Truffle oil. 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 And then Oh, I can smell the <laughs> Okay. Gonna put this in for twenty five to thirty minutes till it's golden brown. We're gonna make the herb butter now. 3 fourth of the softened butter, parsley, half the garlic, a fourth of a tea. Wow, it's a lot of specifics. So, half of the garlic, I guess that's about half, the parsley, pepper, salt. Mix. So, we kind of melt the butter a little bit and put it into two separate little cubes or circles and then you're going to put it back in the fridge and let it firm up and then you're going to use it again before you actually cook. Moving on to step five, four. Cook the steaks. Heat two teaspoons of olive oil in a medium non-stick pan or a medium heat. Add the steaks to the hot pan. So we're not following directions and doing our own thing, it seems. We're supposed to leave it for four to five minutes per side, but instead we flipped it about two minutes in or so, two to three minutes, and then we're going to actually put it in the oven. His idea. Breaking even more rules and putting butter, even though it said not to do that. So how long are we going to leave it in there? Until it looks beautiful. Taking a second to add some spice because we're a little worried about the truffle oil. Truffle oil being a little too strong. Just reminiscing over the beautiful meal we had once 
It was the Korean pork noodle bowl from Home Chef, and it was by far like one of the best meals. Another one that we really liked. This is the Home Chef binder that comes when you first sign up with them, and you actually get a little introduction to the Home Chef family and explains all this different. I'm gonna leave in the description box a link to the Parmesan crusted pork chop and the Bang Bang shrimp tacos that we made already. Just so you guys know, we've done Blue Apron before. That was the original one we've ever tried and we loved and we've committed to them for a while. But we decided we wanted to try out other styles. We did Home Chef, we've tried Plated, and we want to try Hello Fresh. Didn't cook how we wanted them to. So we're putting up the oven because the fries are starting to look a little like they're getting golden, but it still has a way to go. And then this is how the steaks look now. So now we're gonna use that pan to cook the green beans and we're gonna use one fourth of a cup of water, cover, and wait four to five minutes. Cup of water in the pan. Green beans. Cover. I'm almost out of wine. Update on the potatoes. So now in a bit, we're gonna add the remaining butter, remaining garlic, turn the heat to low and saute for two minutes. Since we used extra butter on the steaks to cook it, we decided we're gonna split one of these up and amongst the two steaks and then the other one we're gonna use now for the green beans. Here's the butter. We're adding the remaining garlic. These green beans look delicious. So the potatoes are taking a little longer than we expected, but we're also pretty picky about wanting them to be nice and crispy. So I think they're ready. So overall, we both really enjoyed this meal. We would give it about four out of five stars. The steak is delicious and buttery. The green beans are soft and flavorful. The potatoes are, well, it's spicy because we put spicy seasoning, but the truffle oil, truffle oil. Truffle oil. Well, is a nice little, it's not too strong, it's nice. And yeah, approved.